Hello, welcome to this video. In this video, we will see how to create animated scatter plot in R using Plotly. We are going to use the Gapminder dataset from Gapminder package, and here is an example of animated scatter plot showing how the relationship between life expectancy and GDP per capita evolved over a period of time from the year 1952 through 2007. Let me run this for you. Things to notice, we have life expectancy on the y-axis and GDP per capita on the x-axis. We got a timeline with years. Animation is produced by transition of individual scatter plots frames through these years. Mind the word frames and we will talk more about it soon. Then we have a play button. This is to trigger the animation and can be stopped by clicking on any year. Label showing which frame is running at a given point in time. Let's get to our studio. We'll begin with loading the required packages. First we have the Gapminder package to access the Gapminder dataset, then Plotly for the Plotly plots, dplyr for any data manipulation. Here we have used the filter function from dplyr package. In case you do not have these packages, install them using the install.packages function. Now let's have a quick look on the Gapminder dataset. It has 1704 observations across six variables. And we are interested in relationship between life expectancy and GDP per capita over years. Data is available for every five years, 1952 through 2007. Now let's create a simple scatter plot with life expectancy versus GDP per capita for the year 2002. And then we will modify this to create frames and animation effect. We'll start with Gapminder data, apply filter for the year 2002. This filter function is coming from dplyr package. Add plotly to it. Add markers for the scatter data points, defining the X and Y variables. Let's give a title to it. Define the X axis as log for GDP per capita to bring in some linearity. And finally, let's hide the legend and run this. We now have a scatter plot. This is for the year 2002. Imagine having similar scatter plots for multiple such years. It may not be so easy to establish the change in relationship or to visualize the change in relationship of the two variables across so many years. How about transitioning through these individual plots, the so-called frames, giving it an animation effect? To achieve this, we will use an argument called frame and map this to variable that goes on the timeline. In our case, this is the year variable. We can remove this filter as we do not need it anymore. We have already configured the frame which will be used for animation. Let me add some hover text and run this again. And here we have the animated scatter plot. Link to the GitHub code is given in the description section. Thanks for watching.